Okay, what we have here is a Polytech CLV 800 laser Doppler vibrometer. Um, you can see the laser output is here, it goes through a prism, beam splitting prism here. Uh, the path goes through here, then turns the corner with this prism, goes through this uh, Faraday rotator, which is just an optical isolator, and also on this end is a beam sampling signal, which then goes off to another prism and into a photo detector. Then the main beam continues out through this fiber launcher. This is a flexure that allows you to align the beam so it's launched properly into the fiber optic cable. This is a fiber optic cable. Goes into the shielded armored fiber optic cable and around and around and around and up to the head uh, where we have a CLV700 unit. CLV700 has a Bragg cell in it operating at 70 megahertz. <clears throat> so we get an incident beam that is uh, uh, modulated uh, 70 megahertz off frequency. And if you look over here, you can see the laser beam is right there on the air conditioner right now. And what happens is that beam returns back into the uh, same objective lens that the emitted beam goes to. Uh, the output of this uh, from, from this unit, the reflected beam then goes back in this way, back through this, back through the isolator and uh, ends up uh, hitting the mirror here and going into this prism which goes down into a photo detector. So what you have is a shifted and unshifted beam heterodyned together. Since uh, those are heterodyned together, uh, they form a 70 megahertz output which comes out on this little SMA connector right here. And what I'm doing is I'm listening to that signal on a single sideband um, FM receiver so you can actually, or I'm sorry, single sideband receiver so you can actually hear the FM Doppler shift of the beam. So if we turn this up, we can hear this. It's very, very sensitive because the Doppler shift for a red laser is about one and a half megahertz per meter per second. So we're listening down in the kilohertz to 100 hertz range in terms of the frequency shift. So that's, uh, that's what you're hearing if I jump up and down. Again, very sensitive. This beam basically uh, is shooting over there to the air conditioner on the wall. Uh, but because the uh, tripod is not particularly stable, you are hearing um, the uh, Doppler shift of that beam. So this is a 70 megahertz IF output that we're then listening to on a receiver at 70 megahertz. And that's in single sideband mode. So we can actually hear that frequency shift is an audible tone change. Anyway, I paid about $200 for the whole thing. Uh, I had to replace the laser. The laser was bad. And then I had to realign everything as well, including the realignment of the Bragg cell, which is in here. But anyway, that's my uh, $200 laser Doppler vibrometer.